Hello Virgo, welcome to Faith Connection 777. This is going to be a general reading for you guys for mid-month, November 2020. Hope you're doing well, Virgo. If you're in the U.S., hope you're getting excited and ready for Thanksgiving vacation, despite all that's going on in our world currently. Well, let's see what's coming in for Virgo, mid-month, November 2020. Messages of light and love. Keep in mind, these are general readings, so not all these messages here are going to resonate with you. Please like, share, and subscribe to support this channel. I really appreciate it. First card out, we have the, the Queen of Cups. This is a maternal mother energy here. Either you or someone you're connecting very closely with. We have the Knight of Wands. We have the Strength card, card of Leo coming out here. Bottom of the deck, we have the Justice card, Libra and Energy. So, we have a player energy here, okay? Or what may be perceived as a player energy here, okay? Um, I think it's possible you have had to hide how you really feel about this individual. With the shrink card here, I think you're showing an air of confidence when in all reality, um, I think this person might make you feel a little bit weak on the inside. We have the tower coming out here. So sudden change. Uh -huh. um, so I think this person well, tell me more, Spirit. We have the death card. So it could be that this individual um, that you're that you're coming into an alignment with, or that you're in a relationship. Anyway, this King of this Queen of Cups energy here. There may be an ending. You may have had an ending with this individual, and it's going to be very sudden. Okay. I feel like this person may have been playing you. Yeah, I think this person may have been playing you. We have the Ace of Wands. So there was some kind of um, something you're trying to make happen with this person. And they ended up not really putting all of their effort towards you. And I think that you really were hoping for more here. Tell me more. We have the Moon. This person could be... A Pisces. We have a Libra in energy here. We have Pisces. We have Scorpio. We have um, Leo on the table here. We have all signs really, but the, somebody could have been keeping something hidden from you about their intentions with you, Virgo. This could be a, um, you know, this Pisces person, or this could be uh, just a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces doesn't have to be. We have a five of swords here. So it looks like you might be having to have an argument with this individual. Okay, you may have had an argument with them or something of that nature where you find out that they were just playing you in some way. Okay, there's an ending here to your relationship. Possibly it could be coming very suddenly for you. You find something out here. Tell me more. Okay, we have the Justice card coming out again. So it looks like karma might be handed to you in this situation, okay? Um, you may have been kind of playing the field in your past as well. Um, and so some of you here are going to feel what it felt like to be on the other side of that. Okay, this isn't for every single Virgo out there. You also have a situation where Yeah, it just looks like karma is being handed down here. I mean, it came out twice. There could be this is ending was meant to teach you some kind of valuable lesson here, Virgo. Okay.
Okay, yeah, we have the Knight of Wands twice. So someone here was playing, and I think that you may have learned a very valuable lesson from this whole situation here. Someone wasn't being completely authentic with you, and I think you may have learned some kind of lesson from it. Take this how it resonates. Uh, Ten of Swords. Yeah, this person may have betrayed you even, okay? In some way. They lied to you in some way. Three of Cups. This could be a friend of yours as well. This, this may not even be a relationship situation. This could be a just a friendship situation where you're connecting with this individual who wasn't just wasn't being authentic with you. Okay. This this situation is gonna help you realize something about your own self that needed to be highlighted. Okay. We have the King of Cups energy here, and this could be in relation to a father figure as well, okay? This could be how your father um, perhaps treated you in the past or how your father treated your mother in the past or something of that nature for some of you here. This could really be bringing you into a King of Cups energy or you could be moving towards a King of Cups energy where someone here is very calm and um, nurturing and loving and um, this is a father that you're possibly coming into connection with. This person could also, if this is someone's father here, I'm, I'm going to play it out here. And I know that I probably shouldn't say this, but you may have experienced some kind of death in the family that you're having to cope with and deal with. And part of this is helping you learn and grow. Okay. Okay, Virgo, that is what I have for you guys. Sending you love and light. I will see you in the next one. Take care.